In this video, we're going to show how to approve an expense. So I'm already logged in as a user who has the permission to approve expenses. There are several ways to get to the same approval screen. As an approver on your home screen, you can see the items awaiting your approval and that there is one expense awaiting approval. There are also notifications in the bottom half of the screen under the approve tab to show the items awaiting your approval. Clicking on one of these links or this link will take you to the same screen as if you were to go to your menu, expenses and approve. Your menus may look slightly different depending on what has been configured for your company and your user. Once you are in the approval screen, you have a high level view of what expenses are awaiting your approval. So in this particular example, there's just one and I can see the ID, the person it's been raised for and how much it's for. I can also see using the flags, how many lines there are and the fact that there are attachments. To see more information and to approve the expense, select the arrow on the left hand side, which will reveal the lines. Along the lines, you can hover over if there's been any attachments to see what the attachments look like. If you want to see them in more detail, you can either click on them or you can go to your attachments tab and view them there. Other information that is available to you as the approver are any details that the user entered on the lines. If they are claiming in a different currency, then you can see that here. Any notes that the user has raised against that expense will be visible to you. And if you want to add notes, you can do. Just click on edit notes, add in any extra notes and just don't forget to save. These notes are only visible within WAP and are not going to be posted back to Sage. If you are checking budgets, that information will be available on the budgets tab and the approval history will grow as the order progresses. To approve the expense, come back to the lines tab and from here, you can either approve a line at a time or click on approve all to approve all the lines that you have in that expense. And that's it, that's your expense approved. If you now return to your home screen, the expenses has been removed and the notification has disappeared. And that's all you need to do to approve your expense.